Alright, today I'm going to be showing you guys how to play stretch resolution on Fortnite or any game. Basically, two steps to this. You will need NVIDIA control panel, so GeForce Experience, NVIDIA, um, Shadow Play, you need to download that. Or if you have a graphics card, NVIDIA already, it will already let you do it. So if you guys enjoyed the video, make sure you guys drop a like, subscribe. A lot of people ask me how I play stretch resolution, so I'm just going to be doing a tutorial. I previously made a tutorial, but it was the stupidest video ever. It didn't like show exactly how to do it. This is actually a new ver new way of doing it, and it's just so much better. So you want to right click on your desktop, open up NVIDIA Control Panel, and you will come up with a list uh, of resolutions that you can use. So these are the ones that you can already use. All these ones here I've created. So basically, I'm just going to be showing you guys how to actually uh, create a custom resolution. So uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoy it. And uh, yeah, let's get into it. So what I'm gonna do is I'm quickly, uh, I'm gonna quickly delete this. Sorry about the black screen. All right, so I'm gonna delete that. And what I'm gonna do is create custom resolution. You don't need to delete that. I'm just doing it so I can show you. And whatever resolution you want, I'll put a list on the screen or in the description of what resolutions are the best to use for Fortnite. Um, so I'm just going to be demonstrating on 1600. If you have never played stretch, I recommend 1600. If you go too stretched, like 1080 by 1080, trust me, it is impossible to change. For instance, I tried 12, 8, 1280 by 1080. It literally looks like default. It looks like native. It looks literally looks like 1920 by 1080 because I'm so used to that much stretched. I can't play any other. So you just want to change this, and if you need to change this, then do it. But I don't recommend changing this because 1080 is your monitor, so it will make black bars on the side. Then what you want to do is click test. Now I'm not going to do it because, you know, actually you know, I'll do it for the video. And then you want to click yes when it pops up. Okay, so it may pop up with something. Um, so now you can see I've done it. Um, it will make one here, and then what you want to do is click OK. And now you've got it here. Now what you guys want to do, um, once you've made this, you want to go down to Adjust Desktop Size and Position. Um, so I'm going to apply these changes. Okay, so now it's gave me stretched, so you're going to see a black bar for a minute, sorry about that. Then click Yes. And then you it says Adjust Desktop Size and Position. What you need to do is click full screen. It might be on aspect ratio for you, but you need to put it to full screen. Then you need to scroll down and click override the scaling mode set by games and programs. Um, trust me, you need to do this or it's not going to work. And then make sure resolution. Just leave your resolution as what it's gave you or put it on for you. And that is basically it. The next step, what you need to do is close this. You want to open up your Epic Games Launcher. You want to go to the Windows key down here, uh, or just do Windows key R on your keyboard. But I can't do that because I've got gaming mode on on my keyboard. But if you can't do that, then do percentage app data percentage. It will open a folder here. And what you want to do is you want to go to app data, local, Fortnite game, saved, config, Windows silent, game user settings. There's quite a lot, so make sure you get the right one. Game user settings dot ini. It will open this, and what you want to do is you want to change your resolution size to whatever your preset is, what you made. So I made a 1600 by 1080. Um, change this to whatever your one is. 1600. I'm not going to save this though, obviously, because I don't use it. But change this, and then change this. So basically what this does is it tracks it in the game, so it actually stretches it in the game. All you've done here is stretch your um, desktop resolution, so you've not actually stretched your Fortnite. You can just do it this way instead of doing it on NVIDIA, but it's pretty bad. It can mess your PC up, so I recommend doing it on NVIDIA and here. And then all you want to do is click the X and click Save. And boom, you're good to go. Obviously, I'm not going to do that because I don't want to use this res because I am I play 1080 by 1080 But that is pretty much it. Um, and if you want to go back to normal and you don't like it, just go to Change Resolution. And then scroll down, it should say 1080p 1920 by 1080 native. Then you want to click apply. Your screen, both of your screens will go back, or your one of your screens will go back. And it said, it would say your desktop configuration has changed. We like to keep these changes. Then you click yes, and boom, no black bars on the screen for you guys anymore. So went straight to this, and then yeah, 
and if you want to make more resolutions click custom I've got so many here I recommend using 1600 or 1440 don't go any lower because trust me you'll regret it after like a month because you won't be able to go back to any higher but I use 1080 by 1080 sometimes 1000 by 1080 sometimes 900 yes extremely stretched but anyway that is it for the video if you guys enjoyed it wait yeah okay uh, what did I just do I, I don't know what, oh I've just put it to 900 by 1080 never mind sorry about the black bar <laughs> but if you guys did enjoy the video make sure you guys smash a like subscribe to the channel and that is it for me thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys all in my next video goodbye